Blair Marvin. I'm the Vice President of the Augusta Metro Chamber of Commerce. And to Amy and your team here, congratulations on a wonderful brand. I had the personal pleasure of experiencing it a few years back when it was in the Augusta market. And so when I heard that it was coming to Evans under this new ownership, I was very excited. Um, Good afternoon, everyone. We're uh, at another beautiful afternoon here in uh, Evans. We're in Mullins Crossing, uh, and we're here at Apricot Lane Boutique. Uh, we're here with Amy Hart. Area, you uh, are in a wonderful location here in Washington Road with the, the Belks and the Mullins Crossing area. And Jordan Trotter was integral in helping them find this perfect location. And Dennis Trotter from that group serves on our executive board. So they're a very important member of the community. You picked a good one to help you find this great spot. So My husband and I moved here about 11 years ago. Um, we're a military family. So uh, Plant Vogel brought us here. So he works at Vogel still. And um, so yeah, 11 years and we've just been loving Evans. Haven't wanted to live anywhere else. And what made us decide on Apricot Lane is because it's locally owned and locally run. And we can make decisions for purchases and we can decide what we do and don't carry in our own store. So it's a women's boutique. I know there's a lot of kids boutiques in Evans, but this is focused on women. So anywhere from high school up through college, moms, grandmoms, everyone can walk in and find something special for them. It's all things, accessories, purses, bags, jewelry, clothing, unique gifts. We, you know, we're looking at high school girls, college girls, moms, older moms, grandmoms. That's kind of wide range. We like to have all women that come in here feel beautiful, feel that they can find something that they love to wear. The corporate world of Apricot Lane focuses a lot on giving back to community and um, underprivileged people in other countries. It's very much about giving back and that is what touched my heart and made me decide on Apricot Lane as a franchise. One of the things that I love about Apricot Lane is they partner with um, nonprofits. And one of them is called Three Strands and what it does is help try to rid human trafficking. So it employs and it rehabilitates victims of sex trafficking and giving them jobs. And so we sell some of their products here in our store. It is a larger franchise. There's multiple stores throughout the country. There's only three in Georgia now. So I'm the third location in Georgia. We just commend you on taking the plunge into entrepreneurship. Um, Amy has already signed up for our Small Business Marketing Academy. So she is ready to hit the ground running. Um, and we uh Blair and, and thank you all for being here and this is obviously the most exciting part of the day and, and the uh, the ceremony is actually cutting the ribbons. Um, and we just appreciate her seeing the value in supporting the Chambers of Commerce as a new business. We know that for any business, every penny, every dollar counts. And so to make that investment is very uh, meaningful to both of us. And we look forward to supporting you on your journey and watching you grow as a successful business owner. Thank you for your support and congratulations. We celebrate you today. Let's give her a round of applause.